guys, welcome back to another Lifestyle with Kim Litvak. Today, we are going to dive into all the new home trends. Uh, so stay tuned for some really cool shots and just a fun time. And I'm gonna be talking to one of the area builders to kind of get you a good idea of 2022 leading into 2023. again to Lifestyle with Kim Litvak. Today we are here with Christy, one of my awesome friends who is going to talk about trends and new builds. Um, I know some, sometimes folks may have an idea that new builds are kind of out of their possibilities. Here we're going to talk about ways that it's not outside your possibilities and all the fun things that are going with it. So thanks for joining me today. I really do appreciate it. My pleasure. Um, when you asked about some of the most popular trends in new construction for 2022, mm -hmm. uh, the first thing that came to mind was the importance of having a home office space. Mm. Um, COVID brought on the realization for a lot of people that they needed a dedicated space if they were having to work from home or doing school from home. So the home office has literally within the last year become one of the most sought after and almost required aspects of a home where new construction is concerned. I would absolutely, I am seeing that across the board as well in, in all worlds of real estate that folks need that dedicated space because a lot of folks aren't, aren't there with the C word, <laughs> they're never going back to the office. That's right. Yes. That's right. And my own family, he's never going back to the office. So um, we needed those dedicated office spaces. So absolutely. Yeah, that's so cool. One of the next trends in new construction is smart home features and home automation. Things like the programmable thermostat, front door access by keyless entry, and a control panel and smart switches that allow you to plug things in and be able to operate them from your smartphone. It gives you the ability to start dinner in a crock pot from a flip of a switch that happens from your smartphone. And that is so awesome because how many times, I mean, in our jobs, our jobs run over, like we can't plan things and you can be like, no, dinner's still happening. And not only that, but I know I was mentioning to you earlier, right now there's a thermostat war in my house. I so need one of these so I'm not being heated out of the house and I can do that from the bed and no one knows I even changed it. That's awesome. <laughs> yes, it is. One of the big ones for me is my kids always forget their key or lose it or lock themselves out. And with a quick text, I can hit some buttons and on my smartphone and I can unlock the front door for them so that they can get in. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, and that, I mean, there's so much security with that too. So that's really cool. Absolutely. Yeah. The heart of any home is a kitchen and the mm -hmm. island has become one of the most sought after features in new construction. It's the place the kids have breakfast in the morning. They stop after school here to do their homework. And at night before they go to bed, it's the place where everyone gathers for a bedtime snack. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I mean, anyone who knows me knows right here is where my heart is, where all of family and friends gather around. You could grab a glass of wine. You're making dinner. You're having the ambience. You have your kids running around. Like it's literally, it is just like you said, the heart of the home. It's perfect. <laughs> With everybody buying in bulk, the pantry has become a huge sought after feature and trend for new construction. It's the place where you put all the toilet paper. <laughs> this is where it went all last year. <laughs> <laughs> Another big trend with new construction is in the hall bathroom upstairs that services the bedrooms. Having the ability to separate the space out so you can have one person in here getting in the shower, someone out here with the ability to get ready, where both can have privacy and expedite the process. Yeah, so another really good one, like you were saying, second floor laundry is always huge. And what were you saying about this room? I call this room the Costco room. <laughs> it's the room that you can use for all the extra storage. Uh, it's a place where you can store pet things. And with the laundry room, it being on the second floor mm -hmm. is the place um, where all of the laundry is typically made is upstairs with the bedrooms. Yeah, very true. So you have to lug steps and things like that. So, so true. I couldn't agree more. And the other thing that we were kind of talking about in regards to trends, I mean, what is the number one subject really is color. What are you seeing in the world of color? Well, 50 shades of gray, of course. <laughs> yes, of course. Gray has absolutely become the go-to color. Yeah. in new construction. Yeah, I mean, you can match anything with it, absolutely. And this color is kind of like, like you were mentioning, it's kind of a grayish, agreeable gray. 
is like the top color because you can put anything with it, literally. That's right, neutral yeah. color that you could add any pop anywhere to bring it all together. Yes. Thank you so much for taking the time to kind of discuss 2022, 2023 trends of new builds with me. This has been so much fun, thank you. It was really a great opportunity, I appreciate it. New construction's a lot of fun, it's a great opportunity for people and I'm happy to be able to showcase it. Yeah, it is a lot of fun. You're absolutely right. Again, we, we kind of started with folks kind of think that new bills are unattainable. They really aren't, especially when you have spec homes, um, as you do. Uh, so folks, make sure to reach out to me um, in regards to any spec homes and things like that, because you don't have to worry about prices increasing and what have you, or multiple bids might I mention, you just know what you're spending and you get a beautiful new home that you have nothing to fix. It's ready to go and absolutely, I mean, come on, it's absolutely gorgeous. so much for tuning in to Lifestyle with Kim Lit back today. Please remember to like, comment, and hit that bell down below so you don't miss any of my upcoming episodes. We do all kinds of fun things here of talking to area builders. We do cooking, which obviously you've seen a lot of, and just going about in town and getting to meet some fabulous people. So I can't wait to see you next time, and thanks again for tuning in.